the audacity. I was going to say, let's talk about your conundrum. Unmitigated gall. Because they had, we, we have, have a dream. dream. Pissed you off to no end. To no end. Oh, we're back with this piece of butthead. Piece of butthead. Fantastic. Let us talk. Is everything okay, Lieutenant? Chris was on patrol last night. He was attacked by a bunch of deviants. Ah, so if we would have killed him. He was saved by Marcus himself. Was Chris okay? Yeah, he's in shock, but he's alive. Mm. Why okay, are so, you so, still so, in the same suit? That we picked out. Because it's you... only been a day. Oh. My bad. I'm sorry. Wait, how did you find Camps? I remember this guy was all over the media when Cyberlife first started selling androids. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. I, I mean, this would calls. probably be an awesome view if not for this. I mean, it's kind of still an awesome view now. Yeah. I won't lie. Will it kind of let you look around a little bit more or no? Nah. Okay. That's oh, the android yeah. at the beginning of the game. I'm uh, Lieutenant Hank Anderson, Detroit Police Department. I'm here to see uh, Mr. Elijah Kamsky. Please, come in. You are munching them crackers. I'm sorry. Eat them crackers. 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 Eat them crackers. My stomach is Make sure you munch them crackers. I'll let Elijah know you're here, but please make yourself comfortable. I was expecting you to drop an every ever with me. Yeah, it's snowing, and that's a nice little tree. Mm-hmm. Shall we use it, or? We shall, but first. Analyze? It's time to analyze. Oh, okay. Isn't that a man uh, Yes, it is. Yeah! Nice girl. Uh, D? Indifferent. It's not a girl. It's an android that looks like a girl. I know what it is, Connor. Hmm. Nice place. Space tourism on. So we're going into space, and this is the main everything. story that we have in this world. Yeah. Deviant androids going into space travel is a thing yeah. that we can do with space tourism. Impatient. Kamsky is one of the great geniuses of the 21st century. Oh, that's nice. It'll be interesting to meet him in person. Sometimes I wish I could meet my creator face to face. So Kamsky's God. I'd have a couple of things I'd want to tell him. To the androids, yes. Guess what I'm saying? Yeah. So we're supposed Why to the fuck did you ask us to sit down just to stand back up? To see if we could sit down? The hell? I am I supposed to be waiting? Am I supposed to be doing something? Because I thought sitting down would cause the end, but Yeah, I'm supposed to just wait. Okay. This is like they're legitimately like making you wait, wait. Oh, there you are. Glad you will see you now. Damn right he will. Wait. What the? F wait. What is huh. happening? Is it blood? Or no, it's just water. But it's just, it's just the fact that he's just got. Just a moment, please. Oh, there you are. Are you naked? No. He's nah, good. he got it. Got a pair of trunks on. You piece of shit. You have a five minute time limit. You do? No, I don't. Oh. Yes. So, I mean, are we having a fuck fest? Like, what's going on right now? I would like to go swimming too. I bet you went faster than you. Okay, do you, you don't walk faster. Lieutenant, time me. Yo, asshole, I actually work for a living. Can you get the fuck out the pool? Let us have a conversation so I can go on about my damn day. Yeah, please get out the pool because I don't want to sit here and watch. You're over you. here just swimming. Get your Michael Phelps. Like you have on. all goddamn day. In your own personal Android Grotto. Oh, you know you are a fucking. And this motherfucker's got a man, man bun. bun. You bitch. 
In 2038, the man buns come back. And they're still as douchey. Ugh. God. I'm Lieutenant Anderson. This is Connor. I mean, this asshole's just what lapping around the pool. Like, like, dude, I'm Sir, a police officer. I got shit to do. I know you left Cyberlife years ago, but I was hoping you'd be able to tell us something we don't know. Like, what is RA9? That would be nice. Deviants. Fascinating, aren't they? Oh my Perfect god. Are they? With infinite intelligence. Now they have free will. I'm not gonna like a lot of Machines are so superior. Can we kill him? Is that an option? I don't think so. Humanity's sure. Greatest I'm pretty sure we can. Threatens to be its I would just love to kill him. Isn't that wrong? No, ironic is like rain on a wedding day. Yeah, you pick, because I don't like it. It's a free ride. Deviance. You've already paid. Do you know anything that could it's some good advice that you just didn't take. And who would have thought it figures? It what? It figures. It figures. It figures. Oh, my God. That be helpful or we will be on our way. What about you, Connor? That is a plush carpet. Whose side are you on? He is still a dick. Be direct. I'm on the human side, of course. <laughs> well, that's what you're programmed to say. Motherfucker! But you. I what just... You really want. Mm. Mm. Oh, I'll tell you what I want, what I really, really want. Mm. I'll be troubled. What I want is not important. I wanna, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna. I really, really, really wanna zig a zig and shoot I'm this sure asshole. Is that a question of algorithms and computers? What the fuck? I don't like this man. I don't like him. It's me. Oh, that shit broke me right there. What the fuck? I just don't like him. <laughs> I really, really, really want to zig a zig shoot this asshole. <laughs> like, God. One of the intelligent models developed by CyberLife. Young and beautiful forever. You are creepy. That is incredible. For you to be talking all this shit about like. How oh androids are on. Like, why aren't you employing it? deviants? I got a headache. Because I just, I can't keep listening to this man. For a living being. With a soul. Are you, you are pulling out a gun. I'm going to throw up. Are you, oh, oh, I went from being indifferent to you, but wow. question. Connor, please just Mr. just turn around. And I'll tell you all I know. Pull this man's tongue out and then just shoot him in his tongue. If you feel it so. So he can never speak again. But you'll leave here without having learned anything from me. Okay, I think we're done here. Come on, Connor, let's go. Sorry to get you. What's out more here. important to you, Connor? Your investigation or the life of this android? Are you fucking kidding me right now? I can decide who I am. I just want to shoot the fuck out of you. Like, I literally just want to spend three hours just shooting you to no end. That's enough. You Connor and your bun. The trigger. Connor, don't. And I'll tell you what you want to know. Don't shoot. Fuck you, bitch. Cyberlife's last chance to save humanity is itself a deviant. Wow. I'm not a deviant. You're a piece of shit, you Elijah. You prefer a machine rather than accomplish your mission. You saw a living being in this android. You showed empathy. And if I'd have shot, you would have lost a friend, so-called friend, or something. Fuck you. Uh, he's a fuck. She, he wouldn't have lost a friend. He would have lost a fuck yourself. buddy. But you got Don't two more in the freaking pool. Stand up against your creators. What can be worse than having to choose between two evils? 
get out of here. You are a dick. Yep, this uh, this episode just pissed me off. You are a legitimate dick. Yeah. By the way, I always leave an emergency exit in my programs. You never know. Why didn't you shoot? I just saw that girl's eyes, and I couldn't. That's all. You're always saying you would do anything to accomplish your mission. Okay, because see, you don't start. Thinking you let it go. Yeah, I know what I should have done. I told you I couldn't. I'm sorry, okay? Well, maybe you did the right thing. Oh, Hank still loves us. Oh, Hank. Eh. You earned yourself a handy in the front seat of that car. Yeah. Unlike that. Did we get most of it or some of it? There's a lot more. Oh, we could have shot. Okay, so that's what that decision is. I don't know what this part is. Yeah, I don't either. I'm kind of curious, though. Because, like, we read, the, we read the magazine, right? Yeah, we did. Yeah. So what was this part? That is a good question. Okay, this man just made me seriously nauseous. Asshole. Well, we had a short episode for this one. I kind of... I'm kind of curious. If you want me to be honest. You are? Yeah. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. Since, since we had a pretty short episode on this one. I'm going to stop that. Mm -hmm. Go back to the main menu. Mm -hmm. and this time, we're going to shoot. But we're not saving. Of course we're not. Okay. We are, of course, not going to save. See, I'm not going to make I'm not mm -hmm. going to make y'all go through all of this. So here's what's going to happen. We're going to we're going to cut right about here and uh, we'll pick it right are back up. When we're Schrodinger's back to that path? decision to shoot. All right. Until all right. So catch you in a few it. minutes or catch you in a at once. few seconds, like I guess. This. All right, well, we're back and we're making the decision because we're going to shoot this chick. Just try to see what happens. No. Yeah. Beautiful forever. Still creepy. Very creepy. Will never <laughs> Still don't like you. See, the is whole point really? about beauty is the fact that it's it fades. <laughs> the, whole, the whole purpose of life is the fact that it ends. Beings. Otherwise, then what's the point? There is no point. With a soul. So but this guy right here with the man bun is a douchebag. But I never understand, like, if you're going to do the man bun, at least, like, go for a hot, go, go for the fade instead of just, like, leaving that shit tapered. Just, how about you just don't fucking do it at all? You won't look like an asshole. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. But then you won't look like an asshole. I mean, but at least you look like a, a like an asshole that knows how to freaking line up his goddamn hair. Does he? He doesn't. I'm saying that's what that's the problem. He doesn't right okay, now. Well, if you had a fade, it looks it would look like actually here. good. Come on, Connor, let's go. Sorry to get you. What's out more of your important pool. to you, Connor? Your investigation or the life of this android? First of all, how is Chloe Sorry, going to just like, you know, have a conversation with this dude after he put her through this? Yeah, I don't think she is. Like, that would piss, I would be kind of pissed off, be like, oh, I'm so glad. Unless there's no bullets in the gun. With free will. Are there no bullets That's in the gun? Enough. Please tell me there's no Connor bullets in the gun before I pull this trigger. Connor, don't. And I'll tell you what you want to know. Okay. Oh, there are bullets in the gun. Wow. Fuck. Test negative. If you choose your investigation over the life of another android, you feel no empathy. That pissed off Hank. Yeah, you think? I'm a man of my word. And how are they laughing? Like what they are you laughing at? Right! I'll tell you all you don't turn around and see this shit? So we only have one question to ask. Fuck it, I want to know about RA9. know who RA9 is. I know we're probably spoiling something, but whatever. The, origin. the first android to awaken. A strange phenomenon, like a spontaneous religion. Yeah, Hank left us all the way. I don't know who RA9 is. I don't even know if it really exists. Maybe it's Messiah. Maybe it's just a myth. Mm. 
But deviants need to believe in something bigger than themselves, even if it's irrational. That's uh, something they have in common with humans. That was, by the way, that was a loud stomach. Yeah. An Girl. interesting question, Connor. But maybe not the one you needed to ask. A war is coming. You'll have to choose your side. Will you betray your own people? Or stand against your creators? I wouldn't like to be in your shoes, Connor. What could be worse? I'm still, I'm still kind of blown that he literally handed me a loaded gun. Yeah, but my thing is though. First of all, first of all, you asked Connor if he was gonna stand or betray his people or stand with his creators. Stand against his creators. Aren't you the fucking creator? I always leave an emergency exit in my programs. I mean, he's one of them. I mean, know. he is the creator, but like, I guess I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. This just isn't. It's probably like an Assassin's Creed situation with the Apple of Eden, and Hank is probably just pissed. that girl for fuck's sake. It wasn't a girl, Lieutenant. It was a machine that looked like a girl. You put your gun against her head and you blew her fucking brains out. I did what I oh, had to do to Connor. investigation, and I'd do it again if I had. To. You're a low life. You don't feel a thing, do you? A machine. That's what you are. You're just a fucking machine. Of course, I'm a machine, Lieutenant. What did you think I was? Yeah, I, I wouldn't have chosen this. <laughs> I thought, thought you were different. Mm-hmm. Oh, fuck. You fucking left me. Ah. Okay, so I'm glad we didn't save this one. Yeah, okay. Thank God. All right. Oh, we still get the uh, we still get the uh, little achievement mm -hmm. for it. Okay. Cool. All right then. So uh, we'll we'll continue more of this story uh, next time on Button Smash. And thank you for joining us. And I hope you're having a great day. But we'll catch y'all later. Deuces.